Is the eclipse good again? So after the updates and adjustment to torpedoes and missiles, is the Aegis Eclipse good again? Shoutout goes to Captain Foxy Loxy, who's made some really good videos already. Check out his videos if you still have trouble with your Eclipse. It seems again the Typhoon infrared torpedoes are best and most reliable. The rest of the components stay as they come. That being said, let's get out to bounty hunting. The Aegis Eclipse is a stealth bomber, so the approach is really easy. We wait till the server gives us the main target, and it's not really important if you are 5 kilometers away or 15 kilometers. The only thing you need is a solid lock. So wait till your ship tells you missile lock before you fire the torpedo. Currently there is not a single ship in the game that you will not one-shot. So just rinse and repeat, we accept the next bounty mission and go for it. Obviously with the Eclipse we aim for ERT missions, because the payout is the best. We'll come to the restocking later in this video, but basically you need ERT missions or maybe VHRT missions at least, to cover the cost of restocking. Next bounty is on a planet, makes no difference for us.
place where I like to go restocking is Shubin Mining on Daymar. That's just because it's in the system where I prefer my bounty hunting. But basically you can go where you like. The eclipse is really fast, so you can make it to the platform and back to orbit in no time. Restocking will cost you 11,000 Alpha UEC for 3 torpedoes. Compared to the 75,000 Alpha UEC you receive for the bounties, 25,000 each, this is still a good profit. And over time, with increased reputation, you can earn yourself a payout bonus. For me, currently 10% extra. You can destroy your ship and reclaim it, re equipped with three torpedoes. In this case, Your delivery time will be 16 set. minutes and 32 seconds. You can reduce this time to 5 minutes 21 seconds if you're willing to pay an extra Thank fee. You. But maybe you have two bounty hunting ships, let's say a Corsair or so, and you can swap back and forth. Spend all the ammo, destroy and reclaim the ship and take the other while you wait. For this video I've completed 10 bounty hunting missions, 9 of them ERT and 1 VHRT, just to see if the eclipse is viable again. In one case one of the torpedoes hit an asteroid, which was clearly my fault. Apart from this I just had one case where the torpedo locked but did not hit in the end. Let me know in the comments if you find out why the torpedo did not hit. As always, thanks for watching. If you like my content, please leave me a like and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, see you in the verse.